are you doing for Christmas? Come on in. I bet you've always wondered what happens when you open those doors. Let's find out. Hi there. I'm so glad you came today. Here's a bulletin. It's what we call the order of service. And you can go straight on in, have a seat wherever you want. Come on in. We also have a second entrance. This entrance allows people with accessibility to come in in a way that works for them. Come on in. When you rise in the building, you meet with an elevator. This elevator can access all floors, including our washrooms, which are wheelchair accessible. You can get to the sanctuary, memorial hall, the kitchen. Once you're in, you can access everything. Someone once called the church and actually asked us, can I come to the Christmas Eve service? The answer is yes. Yes, yes, yes. Absolutely everyone is welcome here. It doesn't matter where you come from, whether you've had faith or no faith. It doesn't matter about any of that stuff. If you're here, you are welcome. No experience necessary, no membership required, no expectations of you. So sometimes at Christmas, we are very isolated. We might be alone in a big city for the first time, or maybe all the people we normally go to church with are away. Maybe this Christmas you're grieving someone you love. I hope you can join us for what we call the Blue Christmas Service. It is a time for hope. It's a chance for us to mark the sacredness of Jesus coming into the world without having to put on smiley faces or sing joy to the world. And it's a chance for you to be with others Remind yourself, you're not actually alone. God is with you. All right, we start at four o'clock on Christmas Eve. This is a short, family-oriented service. It's very interactive. Expect to participate. Expect the unexpected. In this service, you can totally expect to sing your favorite Christmas carols as we tell the story of Mary and Joseph and the birth of baby Jesus. Our 8 o'clock service is a more contemporary service. You're not going to find the traditional story, song, followed by reflection. At 8 o'clock, we strive to find a new way to tell this ancient story, where we bring in angels, maybe through music, shepherds, maybe through dance. You never quite know what's going to happen at 8 o'clock, except to know that it will be expressed through the arts. Still with your favorite carols, still with candlelight. Come and join us. At 11 o'clock, when the darkness descends on the city, come to our service of carols and story. We will light candles and listen in the stillness for the news of the new baby. We will be surrounded by a full choir and your voice is needed. When we say anyone is welcome here, we mean everyone is welcome here.